Let's walk through how modern software companies ship code to production, step by step. Step 1. Plan. Everything begins with the product owner, who creates user stories based on business needs. These stories are documented and managed in tools like Jira. Step 2 and 3. Development developers pick up these stories, write code, and commit it to Git, their source control system. This is where the core building begins. They continuously push code and receive feedback from pull request reviews or user input. Step 4. Build and package. Once the code is committed, it goes through a build pipeline using tools like Junit. For testing, Jacoco for code coverage, and SonarCube for code quality analysis. Build artifacts are stored securely in tools like JFrog Artifactory, ready to be deployed. Step 5. Initial Deployment The freshly built code is then deployed into a development environment, typically running in Docker containers on the cloud. Here, internal testing begins. Step 6 and 7, Testing Phase. From there, features are deployed into the QA environment. The QA team performs regression testing, performance testing, and ensures everything works as expected. Step 8 and 9, UAT Testing. Next, the feature is moved into the UAT environment for user acceptance testing, where business stakeholders validate if the product meets the intended requirements. Step 10. Production Deployment Once approved, the code is deployed into production, often using techniques like feature toggles, canary releases, and A-B testing to safely roll out changes. Step 11. Monitor and Maintain Finally, Site Reliability Engineers, SREs, monitor the live system using tools like Prometheus and Skywalking. They ensure everything is running smoothly, handling alerts, performance metrics, and incident escalations if issues arise. In summary, this pipeline ensures code moves safely and efficiently from idea to live deployment, supporting quality, speed, and user satisfaction at every step.